Good Friday morning and welcome to the Coffee with Craig show. My name's Winston Norman and here are the highlights for today's show. Uh, Colliers reports increase in CE investment volumes. A retail park in Gorzhov Vyelkopolska has sold for 40 million euros and FIO RE Fund has acquired a Czech industrial park. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Coffee with Craig show. We'll be talking about commercial real estate in Central and Eastern Europe. So good Friday morning and welcome to Coffee with Craig. So we are here at the Baltics this week promoting our Baltic Real Estate Awards, which is happening next year, May 22nd at the Radisson RCS in Sopai. Now back to Winston Norman and the news. Welcome back. And today we'll start with a report from Colliers. And uh, the first half of 2024 saw uh, CE investment volumes rise by 29% year on year, uh, contrasting with subdued activity in Europe and globally. Uh, Colliers' latest report suggests uh, 2024 volumes could reach 5.5 billion euros, about half of the 10 year uh, average. Financing costs remain high at 5 to 5.75%, driven by higher interest rates. Uh, Poland leads regional volumes with almost 50% and significant year-on-year -year growth was recorded in some markets despite a 41% decline compared to the first half of the year 2022. Uh, the office transaction share declined globally and in CE with retail retaining the largest sector share and economic, inflationary and interest rate conditions continue to influence market recovery. Uh, moving to Poland and staying in the investment industry and Aquilis and Actium have sold the uh, Silvana retail park in Gorzhov Wielkopolska to Big Polska for 40 million euros. Uh, this marks one of the biggest uh, transactions this year. Uh, the new park will be renamed uh, Big Gorzhov and will offer 25,000 square meters of uh, retail space with 40 shops, including brands like Decathlon, Half Price and the, pro the park is scheduled to open on August the 22nd. And uh, Big Gorshov is Big's, Polska's fifth investment in the country. And it's also notable for the first sale from Equilis's Duodev 2 fund portfolio. And according to Iran Levy, CEO of Big Polska, our activity on the Polish market where we've built a portfolio of five excellently located investments in less than two years, consolidates our position in the retail park sector in Poland. And according to Olivia Bigun, uh, CEO of Equilis, the sale of the park before its opening is a very significant achievement for Equilis. Uh, we are also dealing with the first sale from the Duodev 2 Fund's portfolio of assets since its creation in 2022. And uh, finally for today, staying in the investment market, but moving to logistics and industrial, and uh, FIO Real Estate Fund has acquired Garbe Park Humutov, an industrial park near Humutov main train station for 33 million euros. Uh, the park has a total area of around 29,000 square meters and boasts uh, A-level A energy performance certificate and strong logistical connections. Advisors for the transaction included Haviland Partners, ASB Group, Wilson's, TPA, OM Consulting and Cushman and Wakefield. And according to Martin Polak, Managing Director, Central Eastern Europe at Garbe, this is the success, second successful sale for Garber in Central Eastern Europe in the last two months after a three-year development cycle. We are now at the phase where we are offering our first projects for sale to investors, not only in the Czech Republic, but also in Slovakia and Poland. And those are the highlights from the Europropoly.com website for today. For more news, please join us again on Monday. In the meantime, have a great weekend. Click here to subscribe to the Coffee with Craig show and don't forget to share it with your friends.